Okay, this monster is a Century SM spotting machine. Now, this is a seriously powerful application rod. It's four pound test curve. You're gonna need sort of four ounces of weight to get this thing even moving and get it compressing and get it rocking. Um, it will handle spods up to eight ounces. Um, so it is a, a very, very powerful rod. Um, the idea behind rods like this is that if you're using a rod a long distance rod if you're using an FMA or if you're using an SP or something in the distance range um, and you're going to fish at those sort of ranges it's no good fishing at those sort of ranges if you can't get any bait out of that range so the idea with this being um, as powerful a rod as it is is that you can you can get bait out at the same range that you plan on fishing at um, as we've touched on already the autoclave process is going to really 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 help to reduce the test curve decay and probably the spod rod marker rods to a degree but spod rods more than any any other rod are going to be more susceptible to test curve decay than, than any other any other rod in the bag i mean they, they, like we say it's going to be you know minimum of four ounces up to eight ounces repetitive casting spod after spod after spod after spod you know, most guys will put lots sort of 20 spods over each rod. So for for one, every one cast that you make with one of your fishing rods, you're just going to make sort of a dozen to 20 casts with this one with probably twice as much weight. So the autoclave process really comes into its own with this, as does the ATT, the anti-twist technology. I can't think of a rod that needs to be more accurate accurate than the, than the spod rod. You're going to, once, you, once your rods are accurate and they're clipped up and they're on the spot, you need the bait. If you're fishing tight beds of bait, um, which is synonymous with a spotting approach, you need a rod that's going to have no torsional load and it's going to get your bait out in a straight line all the time and that's what the ATT is all about. The build on the spotting machine, very, very simple. It's a rod that's designed to do a job. The butt section again, very, very thick, very, very powerful plenty to hold on to there on the abbreviated handle you're not going to get your hand slip with this one at all okay 1k weave minimal graphics again a little bit of duplon fuji 20 mil reel seat plain black whippings and as we move down the same 50 mil century sic ring set to complement the marker rod perfectly This is a specifically designed tool to do a job, and it does the job probably better than any other spod rod on the market.